Hello everyone, this is Phoebe and today I want to intro introduce my new project to all of you. Before I get started, uh, I want to ask a few as, as more help from all of you. Uh, my husband Yuji is uh, in hospital right now. Uh, he had a, a thyroid surgery yesterday to be remo removed it and the doctor said that it might be cancer. Um, I'm hoping that uh, if any one of you can send us uh, payers or remember us in your mind, in, it will be highly appreciated. Thank you. So while my husband is in hospital, uh, I got a lot of time uh, at the night, so I finished these two uh, items. Uh, the first I want to introduce you is the purse. Um, the basis is another uh, wallet uh, purse from the uh, 100N shop uh, and then I we made it uh, with this uh, lace, uh, white lace that I bought uh, from a shop online lately um, and then I tried something new which is uh, a, a new idea pop up in my mind which is the rolling twenties uh, I actually know nothing about the uh, fashion, but I like the headdress and the, you know, atmosphere of this um, 20s uh, fashion. So I gather the materials and make uh, these items. Um, this is the first time I use something uh, in silver color. And, well, I think it turns out really well. Uh, he's a lady uh, with elegant uh, body shape and then a beautiful headdress. So I just uh, put in all kinds of here and there, silk colors. And then uh, mainly it is this, uh, it is a whole pieces of bridal lace. You can see it here. And then I cut the uh, center out and put the photo here. And then I have this, you know, beast uh, fringe add to here. And then at the base, use another silver uh, material to cover it up. This is the front. And in the back, uh, once again, uh, silver and white material. Another piece of uh, bridal lace here. and then uh, another big pieces of uh, bridal lace. So this is what I come up with with the purse. And then you can see here this is a, a lace book and this is the first uh, Doidy's lace book lace books that I have made. Um, well, it is a bit tricky or difficult. Uh, sorry about that. Okay. And, you know, many technical problems occurs, but I have fun with that. This is the first page and actually my favorite. Um, another lady with very beautiful hair fixed and then uh, you can see she's so elegant. So I put in a lot of this silver embellishment. Um, and then this is uh, coming from a hair accessory for, uh, for the bride. And then mainly covered in all silver trim. And then uh, this uh, embellishment. This is the first page. On the second page, um, mainly it is uh, with a uh, silver uh, uh, applique. It is, you know, a uh, wing shape, but I cut it up in pieces and then 
um, this is the uh, second page. Another lady with very beautiful headdress, and I put rainstone here to decorate here and here. And this silver trim, which I use in the bottom of the purse, and I I just like this uh, bees bees fringe. So this is the second page. Um, on the third page, uh, a lady looking over uh, the mirror, and then uh, more silver trims, and then uh, some uh, appliques here and there, and. Because this silver applique is so gorgeous, I think I don't need it to uh, decorate too much details. Just let this uh, silver applique express itself. So this is the second and first page. On the next page, uh, I use uh, bridal lace, white lace uh, to change the uh, feeling. Uh, I think elegant is one of the elements of uh, the 20s, so I want to uh, show up here. Uh, this is another uh, big piece of uh, Bido lace, the whole pieces. I cut it up and then shaped it and, uh, and then put a trim on the side here. Oops, on the side here and I think this is what quite beautiful okay so on the next page this is some technical problem I hope you don't mind the beast just won't stick up with the glue uh, and I don't want to use uh, the hot type of glue because the glue will show up I will fix it later thank you so the next page here you can see some of these uh, sparkle uh, trim and here uh, and this is what I want to show you on the next page this is a, a bit of hint um, in this page I use some uh, Venus trim and then uh, mainly combined with the Baito lace and wing stone. I will fix this one. I hope you don't mind. So what this next page is actually this uh, gorgeous uh, shining sparkle color. This is what the hint is about. I love this lady. Very beautiful. She put her fingers on her lips just like saying shh and then this page uh, I put a trim on the side with rainstones and then cover it up with this uh, 3D flowers and pearls and then this uh, applique you see accessory which I cut up uh, it's um, a bit more bigger pieces but I can't use it so I, I cut it up and then cover up with photo picture this is the next page and then this one um, you can see beauty never dies and more uh, embellishment and then shining uh, embellishment and rainstones so on the last page uh, final lady here and then a big pieces of uh, sparkle uh, ever case and then the embellishment I use on the first page here and here this is the last page and then uh, on the spin, I use I make a 
small flower with a trim uh, with a beautiful shape and then uh, finish up with the uh, rainstone button and some uh, embellishment here and then just I don't want the spin to be too heavy so just this small flower Doily is, is absolutely easy and beautiful to make but it needs some technical problem uh, fixing you know because uh, this time I learned that I have to put in the wire or the circle before I finished because I had a hard time doing that I hope that the next time when I do a doily uh, which will be in the coming future it will be easier for me to do so thank you very much for looking i love you